Hey there everybody, how you doing? I am Francis and welcome back to Gaia's Melody Echo Melodies. In the last episode, we finally found Isha, but some help she was. All she did was tell us that she can't help us. Told us about this uh, mystical orb that we had to find in some cave. Didn't tell us uh, really where to look, so we decided to come back to Eon. I know that Dokin and the others are probably not happy about us uh, running off like this, but... Well... We're going to need our help though, so let's get going, I guess. Gotta find everybody. Oh, there he is. That didn't take much detective work. Akira. I'm not sure whether I should be relieved that you came back safe, or furious that you left in the first place. Do you have any idea of how dangerous that was? Yeah, I have a few ideas, yeah. But, but... Enough. Conference room, now! I didn't mean to make him worry. You knew this was going to happen though, Akira. Like, let's be honest. We all knew that was going to happen. Alright, well, we gotta find a conference room. Wherever the hell that was, I don't really remember. Maybe it was down here. Nope, that's locked forever. Locked forever. Down here, maybe? Yep, okay. Hey, everybody! Akira, how dare you leave me like that? Akira's back! Crazy girl's back! <laughs> I got buried. Oh good, you finally decided to show up. Finally, we just sort of followed you here like the moment you ordered us to come here. Now, why don't you start by telling us what you were thinking and what happened to you. Right. Important stuff first. And that's about it. I came back to see if Dokin would lend me an airship to find a cave I'm looking for. I see. Well, you missed quite a lot while you were gone too. Oh, really? Indeed. While you four were away, our little princess went missing. You have a princess? Oh, was your princess the girl with the ears? The cat ears that we thought was baby Kari? I don't think I've ever met the princess who took her. Uh, that's not it. Uh, she just disappeared. Not only that, your friend Choco has also vanished. Oh, well, that's not good. Yeah, she kind of went poof around the same time you guys did. She just was talking about being helpful to everyone and then left. Oh my gosh! I sense there's a great battle heading towards us. I think it'd be best if we focus on getting you full control of those powers of yours first. What? But... What about your sister and Choco? It seems like Choco left of her own free will, like you four did. My sister, the best thing we can do for her is gain strength to fight for her sake. That makes sense. Alright, I understand. Good. Now, if you're ready... Huh? Don't think you can just leave us behind. Hey, you're not leaving us behind again. Y you can't leave us this time. If Akira's going, I'm going. If Cassie's going, we gotta come. Why? Cause she's our babysitter, duh! And of course, we're coming too. You can't stop us, Mr. Dokin. You might as well just give in. Alright, alright. Just don't go dying on my watch. I'll loan you this. The Flight Ocarina! Just use that from wherever and it'll beam you up to the airship. Why don't you give it a go? Oh, okay, so I can literally use it any time to go onto the airship, like, even right now? Dokin, you're so totally awesome! I agree, he is. I'm gonna save first. Alright then! Where is this ocarina? Is it a key item? Yeah, there it is. Okay, cool. Away we go! Whoa! Select a party of four. Oh, the whole team is here. Wow, a lot of my characters are weak except for the people I brought with me. I can level them up. Alright, I'm taking Whip with me. I'm taking Dogen with me. And... We need to level up uh, Kari as well, so you can come as well. Save, yes! 
I literally just saved before using the Flight Ocarina, but if you're giving me the option to save, I will be taking it. Thank you. Chapter 5. Oh! Hello, world map! Where am I? Oh, there I am. Okay, where am I on a map? Oh, I see where I am. Alright, I'm over here. So, will it tell me where I am? Oh yeah, I can tab. Alright, so I'm down there... No, I'm up there by Eon. So, I have to go to... Uh, looks like a place a little bit uh, north of Arbor. Like that forest, huh? I can go to the remains of Terralos? Uh, I guess we can do that, sure! Oh, I can't- Oh, you really- Echo, you didn't make it so that I can go around a world like that? I literally have to- Okay. So this is the remain of Terralos, huh? How do I enter an area? Oh, I just uh, approached uh, the place I have to go, so I can't- I can't land wherever I really want to go. What is that? I believe it's the aura of a magical seal. In short, I do believe there is something down there that someone would rather not be discovered. Could this be the cave we're looking for? Underwater? Dude, that cave needs a name! How about Eerie Cave of Doom? I prefer Happy Cave of Sunshine and Ponies if, if I get a vote. The name can wait, it doesn't matter what it's called. There's no way to even get down there, let alone all the way out of the sea. Got a boat? Uh, unfortunately, Eon isn't in the possession of any submarines at the present. Mira is quite equipped with them, but not us. Lucky for you, bad for the rest of us. If that ore can give Akira control of her powers, just think of what it could do to the, for the baddies. Terralos, Arbor, and Magic, Eon, and Ea. They've all met with Mirik's Wrath. If it becomes even more powerful, then... Then... I don't even want to think about it. I believe my brain has hatched an idea. Well, they are honest, man. My mother is of the Ryo Quan. They have the ability to summon demons and monsters to fight in their place. Like Usagi? Oko, okay, when did you get here? I've been here the whole time. Oko has been helping out on the airship since Choco went missing. Alright, Choco could summon monsters too. Couldn't she, Akira? Do you think Oko can help us? Yeah, that's true. Uh, Choco can summon monsters. She summoned one when we first met her after all. What about you, Oko? You said it's a thing Isagi can do. You're an Isagi, so... Go for it, man! Sandy, it won't do any good. There's a huge difference between Usagi and Ryu abilities. And Usagi summons illusions meant to ward off foes. Oh, and Ryu summons real monsters. Oh, well, it sure didn't feel like an illusion. The Ryu call forth living, breathing beasts. All of which have their own powers and abilities. Kuyo, so your mom will help us? Negative. She can no longer use magic. Well, that's a bummer. Why'd you bring it up then? And I thought you said you had a plan, Doken. Ouch, that's rough, dude. There's a village of Rio, just south of Ian's capital. We might be able to find someone willing to help us there. Alright, let's go find a cool new Rio friend! Wow, wowie, wowie, this is so much fun! A real adventure, through and through! Now, who wants to be left back home? It uh, will be good, Captain Doken, sir. Yeah, yeah, let, let's kick some butt. Oi, what are we going to do now with you two? I said that line completely wrong, but it's okay. And we're back on the airship, so we can't go here yet. And we have to go over there where Ryu is. Can I seriously not land anywhere, like, at all? Only go to places that are quite convenient? Yeah, it looks that way, okay. So I don't really have the freedom to go wherever I want yet. That's a little bit of an upset, but okay. Hello! Adventure chapter, and I forgot to read the name of uh, the town we're in. Uh, so tell me here. Ryu ya! Okay! Save? Oh, I can change party members now! Cool! So save points can do that now, too. 
I'm guessing I, that's been removed from the menu so I can't uh, switch my team. Yeah. Yeah, okay, that was removed. All right. We become full-fledged summoners if we pass the trial at the age of 16. If we fail the test, we are exiled from the village. Wow, that's uh, pretty harsh. Yeah. Yeah, pretty harsh. Either become a summoner or leave. I like to believe that all the evil people in the world are actually good. Just misunderstood. But I fear for the worst, despite hoping for the best. Yeah, you can't... Well, I mean, I guess, uh, yeah, in some cases, like, the evil person is misunderstood. Like, the best thing about a villain, like a good written villain, has a reason for being evil and is not evil, you know, for the sake of being evil. I don't think I'm gonna pass the trial, so I take an up swordsmanship instead. I'm prepared to leave now. Oh, at least you're being prepared. We're Ryu, descendants of both dragons and demons. That explains the horns. The four demons were wiped out long ago now. Ain't none of them left. Dragon Horn Sword! Who can use that? Akira, can you? No, you can't. How about you? Uh, you can use the Queen Knife, which is stronger than your strong dagger, surprisingly. Okay. Iron Sword. Oh, it's a token thing. Wow, all your stats will drop, though. Yeah, I'll put it on, though. A Mana Reflector. That sounds pretty cool. Incredible Ribbon. Resist most status ailments. Well, I think I want to give a cure of that. Uh, your stats will drop a bit, but... Hey, you're protected from most, if not all, status ailments, so we'll go with it. Alright, awesome. Let's uh, save. Save our new settings. Our new equipments. Cool! Cool, cool, cool. Let's go in here. Hello. Do you know fish swim in water? Um, well, yes. Yes, I do, though. Well, I have you, though. There are also mermaids. Mermaids also swim in water. Again. Yeah, very good. Oh, okay. I'm not sure what I was going for here, but just laugh and move on, all right? Oh, you were pointing out the obvious. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Captain Obvious. Came uh, once again to save the day, I see. I always count on that, you know. Zoom in. Look for any hidden stuffies. Move, sir. I don't see any hidden stuffies, all right? I've heard of cat people. Demon people, angel people, rabbit people, fox people, people people! But never monkey people! Well, uh, I have a tail, so I think I'm, pa I'm part monkey. Are you here to see the outer? Why, I'm afraid he's away. You can talk to Mia, perhaps. She's his only heir. Well, only one that's left, that is. Oh. What do you mean by that? That's kind of sad. A homemade shield. Can the homemade shield be any help? Whip coatless. I like whip better with my coat. Oh, you already have a homemade shield. Okay. You can't. And you use other stuff that aren't shields. Okay, well. Unfortunately, we don't have anyone that can make the home... Well, use the homemade shield. Uh, you, you... Will you please? Some people really don't want me leaving. It's true, though. I met mermaid people. She was gorgeous. Light blue hair, a stunning smile. She stopped coming by here after the Isha woman left, though. I guess they were friends? Hmm. Funny you mentioned Isha. We, we met her. She wasn't very helpful, though. Like, she told us some stuff which was pretty nice, but... Not really anything helpful. Like, she told us some places we had to go, but couldn't tell us where to find those places. We have certain rituals. They must be upheld. And their outcomes are final. That's great, mate. Hello. I have a feeling that one day our powers will be used for evil. Like they were in olden days. But until that day comes, I think I'll watch the clouds, take a nap, and enjoy the sun, you know. You know, well, I can. Hello. Oh, are you, uh, the Mia person? Oh. Oh, you're teaching me song, aren't you? That song is almost sad. 
Sad is a song inspired by how cute my horns are. Aren't they just the best? Okay, okay, it's actually my sister's song, but if you like it, make sure to enjoy it lots. I will, maybe I should play it sometime. I still need to find a piano. There was one in the airship, wasn't there? Maybe I should go back to the airship. Yeah, let's quickly do that, shall we? Is there a button where I can go onto that, like, uh... Like, born on the ship? Well, there's a button, I don't know how to do it. Oh, I actually can then pushing, uh, Z. How about, how about that? I mean, like that. Maybe I could visit our places then. Hey, hey! Do you want some my, my, uh, no good lazy dum dum brothers things? Uh, what's your dum dum brother have? I mean, that could help, uh, Kari. Sure! The cool top. It's cool, but not very helpful for us. Ah, uh, I wish I could buy that. I gotta be so broke, though. Oh, that'd be nice to have. Why are all the good things, like, unaffordable? Alright, well, I guess I got some stuff for Kari. There we go. Oh, there's something up there. How do I get up there? Oh. I can climb here, okay. The rear window skin! Let's uh, check it out. I don't know if I'll change it, but we'll take a look. Okay, next. Mm. Yeah, it's not really the worst. I like the R1 a little bit more, but you know what? We'll, we'll stick with it. I kind of like it. It's not very really bad. We'll use it for a little bit. I'll probably end up switching back by the end of this episode, though. Hello, chest. Jabbers! I don't know what a jabbers is. It's not a standard item, apparently. Is it a weapon? It is. It's for gloves. I don't have anyone that can use gloves. Maybe I get a new character here. Who knows? My family's all kinds of messed up. Lots of family stuff happened. So, our mama Isha left. Our papa died a few years ago too. We have a half-sister too. Her name is Nora. But we never met her. I met her. She's kinda strange. See so you at the Magic Academy if you wanna see her. A trendy jacket! Uh, Whipwear's jackets? Maybe he can wear it. Maybe he wants to be cool, hip, and trendy. I mean, it's helpful. Yeah. There we go. Nice. Hi. I hope when I'm big and strong that I'm just like Furek. My love. Well, dream big, it might happen. Oh, I need this. There's a lot of songs I learned that I haven't got to play yet. I'm gonna be learning stuff, guys. It's exciting. We've been holding this back for so long. What a nice, relaxing song. I got a new spell. Yeah, there's more. I like how we gather just to spread out again. I didn't even push a button, by the way. Just not going straight to the next song. But I like that we gathered just to spread out again. That song sounds almost familiar to something I've heard before. I think Final Fantasy IX. And we have more music. I think this is the one we just uh, heard. You use her and I don't remember it. That song is almost sad. Yeah, that's all of them, okay. So we learned some new spells, or songs rather, but let's see. Monster Growl, 
A strong boat rescuing deals fire de elemental and feeble. Doom. Some boat disappointing school of life. Yeah, relatable. Instant death enemies under half HP. Okay. A song of the real people. Winks all enemies. Okay. I mean, this song ain't really that bad, even though it sounds kind of sad, apparently. I don't hear sadness in that, but okay. You do you, Akira. You're kind of weird, I know. Hello? When our kids turn 16, they'll have to take the trial. It's a sort of a magical awakening sort of things. You travel around and get some help from the world. Okay. I always tell my son, if you don't listen to your mother, Bahamut will come after you. Oh, not Bahamut. Why would you tell them Bahamut? He quiets down real fast. That's scary. Yeah. Tell your kid to behave or you're going to summon a mighty dragon king to destroy them. Between you and me, I don't really think my little bro is the summoner type of kid. He's more of a laid back archie type. But the consequences for failing the trial... Uh, the trial? Mm, yeah, us Ryu take a trial when we reach the age of adulthood. If we fail the test, we're banished entirely from our home. It's quite rare to have a failure, but... Uh-huh, uh-huh. The last failure was actually Aria, the current Queen of Eon. Wow, that's a surprise. Well, it really worked out for her in the end. She became royalty. Boy, was her papa ever mad. Us girl Ryu are supposed to have a wedding ceremony after the trial too. But she was of rather important status here. So it caused quite a catastrophe, or so I'm told. I mean, it worked out for her. She became a queen. She got married into the royal family. Can't nap. Bahamut will eat me. Oh dear. Yeah, that's uh... Parents of the century right there. Father and mother of the year. Yeah, behave yourself or we're gonna call a mighty dragon to come eat you. Great. Chest. I want chest. I like chest. The Mandy Hairband. Uh, well, I guess we'll give it to Doken then. That sounds like it could be a Doken thing. Eh, never mind. The fashionable pirate hat is way too fashionable to get rid of. Same for you. If she chose not to be a summoner, we'd be forced to leave the village. But as long as she's happy, I'm sure we'll be fine. I don't want to be a summoner. I want to be a mage. I want to blast people with the power of friendship. Not sick giant dragons of them. Okay, that's... You know, fair. I mean, the laws of this village, I know. I, I get it. The laws of this village are kind of strict. Quite arguably unfair. You obviously won't be able to stay here since you have no intention of summoning a mighty dragon. But that, that's... You know, it's fine. You could go to, uh, Magic, I guess. There's literally nobody there but the Elder anymore, but I'm sure he would love to, uh, you know, teach you the way of Magic and have new, uh, people living with him in his village. I think I have to go through this gate here. Yeah, there's home more over here. How about that? We're surrounded by mountains and protected by Eon. I couldn't feel safer. Well, you have the Prince of Eon here, uh, in your presence. My sister's off practicing her music in the prettiest spot in the village. Oh, I wanted to go too, but I have to guard this place. You should know that people here are very elegant and prideful. Best be on good behavior, travelers. Oh, I'm always on good behavior. Don't, don't you worry about that. Hello? Oh. Good, good. Very flashy. But next time, defend. You know, like I told you. I'm telling you I'm ready. And I'm telling you, no. I can't have you getting kicked out of the village. It, it seems we have guests. Hi. Greetings, travelers. I am Mia of the Ryu. 
Please accept my presence in the place of my grandfather, the Elder. Uh, yeah, I'm Akira. Uh, g greetings are, you know, whatever. Uh, you're so strong, aren't you? Good day, Lady Akira. May I ask what brings you and your people to Ryuya? Uh, right, let's get straight to the point. Uh, I'm on a mission to save my sister from Mirak, er... I sort of need to go into an Arwa arcade to do some treasure hunting. What does that have to do with us? Basically, we're looking to enlist a summoner. We need access to a creature that can take us deep beneath the waves. If you have anything like that, we'd like to borrow it for a bit. Well, no, I... Wait! I believe we can work out an agreement, Lady Akira. You see, there is a beast who lives beneath the volcano, deep within the earth. It has been encased there for a very long time. Only a strong and powerful summoner will be able to free it. I can't say for a certain what you'll find, but it could prove useful to you. Well, if it's a monster in a volcano, uh, forget it. We kind of need to go under water? A uh, fire monster is not going to help us. A volcano, huh? I think I know where you're talking about. We've been there before. Will you come with us then, Mia? Oh, no, I certainly won't be going with you. Uh-huh. Him. Him? This fellow Ferric will be going with you. He probably uses the gloves that, uh, we found. I will. He doesn't sound too thrilled about that, does he? With them? That guy? Well, okay then, Ferric. I guess you'll be joining in on our quest. There's an airship waiting for us, so meet us outside when you're ready. Why are you coming? You coming or what? So you are letting me take the trial. I doubt you could do it alone, but with some friends like them, I'm sure you'll survive at least. And when we don't find this magical water god, you can only create fate. Your own destiny. I'm sure you'll make the right decision. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Fate and destiny, whatever. Least you could do is wish me off as your friend. I see too much of future outer Mia as it is. Don't die, okay? Yeah, okay, okay, I'll take that. He could at least pretend to care. Him! Yeah, something tells me we're not going to get along too well, are we? But yeah, I know where the volcano is. It's on a volcano island. This is our new friend, Ferret. He's a summoner guy. He'll be helping us this time. Okay, so let's see. The volcano... The volcano is on an island not far from here. Last I heard, some monsters took over the place. If they don't miss Monkey here is coming, we need two our people who want to get dirty. This guy... Really? You got something to say, little missy? Uh, <laughs> let's play nice children. So, do we have any volunteers? I think I'll have to put the decision together. What? No one? No one here wants to come play? Fine! I guess I'll just have little Miss Monkey here all to myself. There I'll go! Really? Us two! I want to go too! I also think it wise I go. As a bodyguard, of course. Hmm. Okay then, Akira. You two is the rest of us. We'll wait here. Huh? Who? Me? Shouldn't it Ferric? I mean, this is his... Yeah, I know exactly what will happen if you let him choose. It's your call today. Understood, Captain Doken. Yeah, thanks, guys. Really feeling the love here. Okay, guys, let's... Okay, willing to do good ears. Let's go kick this volcano's at... Let's go, let's go, let's go already. Jeez, honestly, this guy... Yeah, I can't say I like him, no. Not one bit. Alright, so... Akira, Ferret, and... I really want to use Whip some more. Like, I want to use my lower level characters to level them up a bit. Like, Catchy, Terra, and Tarsay are pretty good leveled. Oh my god, Mickey, yikes. Dude, you are so low leveled. Yeah, I'll level you up uh, some other day. Uh, we'll go with Kari for now. 
Alright. To the sacred volcano island we have to go, which is uh, over there. But we'll be doing that in the next episode. This is going to do it for today. Thank you everybody for joining me in Come Back to Guys Melody Echo Melodies. Hope you guys are enjoying this and I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for joining me. Have a nice day. Bye everybody.